Hi, my name is Roger. How are you doing? In this video, I'm gonna meet these guys. Hey, my name is Tobias Granberg. Hey, my name is Rickard Tellebro. Hey, my name is Rickard Lövdal. And I also asked them to say the Swedish word of today, which is... Folköl. Or like they say it... People's beer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but first, I have to drive to Umeå. I'm in Umeå. It's pretty far north on the east coast of Sweden. And I'm gonna meet the band Riff Raff Ruff, who just made their sound check here. Uh, and it's their fourth gig since the pandemic started in March. So I think they are pretty excited to play some music again. And we're gonna talk about how it is to be an entertaining band, entertaining musicians, and maybe especially in the north of Sweden. So let's see what they have to say. Hi, how are you doing? I'm fine. Hi. Nice I'm fine. to see you. Introduce yourself as a band. The band is called Riff Raff Ruff. Swedish, um, cover, Swedish band. cover band from Northern Sweden. We play uh, classic cover songs, I guess. Quite a lot of Swedish songs also from the 50s on up till today. So all, all kinds of yeah. genres and everything yes. from 50s until today. Yeah. When did you start the band? And especially why did you start the band? In 1997. 1997, 23 years ago. Yes, yes. Okay. We've been the same guys since 2002 when you joined. And we started the band because it was fun. <laughs> it was fun? Yeah. Yes. We had some other bands before also. But did you thought that you're gonna, you were gonna make a living out of this band when you started it? I don't know if that was outspoken, but we just keep on playing. So. Well, was that like a dream, but yeah, 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 yeah. the was, goal yeah. was to make a living out of it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So how many gigs uh, every year do you have? Not this year because of the COVID-19 pandemic, of course, but approximately how many gigs do you have? One Around hundred, yeah, one hundred twenty in a year. One hundred, one hundred twenty. Yes. And uh, how many miles? Ooh. English miles? Uh, <laughs> <That's> <laughs> you, can take kilometers. <laughs> you can take kilometers. You can you can do it in about, kilometers. About thirty thousand. Yes. Thirty thousand kilometers. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, 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 one trip around the world. 30,000 kilometers, that should be like 20,000 miles in English, yeah. in English miles, yeah. about. Yes. Yeah, okay. What, what, is your, what is your goal for each gig? What, what is your main purpose for each gig? To make uh, people have fun. That's the main purpose? Yes, and enjoy the music and enjoy the whole evening. And have a good time, yeah. So your goal is sort of making a good mood so that people yeah, have fun. Yeah, and that when you feel uh, that you and the the audience is like the same unit. Yeah. Okay, and we connect. yes. That's, that's, yeah, that's the thing. best so part of you're playing of the, with the audience, yeah. not to the but audience. We, we make them and them make us. Yeah, okay. That's, the, that's a good feeling. How do you approach that? How do you think 
What, what, what's your thought process to, to make the audience feel good? We don't have a playlist. You don't have, you don't have a playlist. No, How do you choose what songs to play then? <laughs> We, we're yeah. arguing. <laughs> we're arguing. Very democratic. We're arguing. <laughs> the, the one who sh sh shouts the loudest. Yeah. <laughs> or the one who starts a song. Okay. <laughs> the one who starts the song. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I would try to, to like read the audience to see what in age and, or in and, mood. And... Or, and, and uh, a lot of, of songs is like you know in 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 what time in the evening you can feel that the, this song is gonna fit in is, it fit in here. <laughs> yeah, but that, that's a that's a that's a good point, and and I was gonna ask you if do you think about the drama of the concert like. Okay, we have to slow it down now. Yeah, we yeah, have yeah. to p push it up. Yes, how? What, what's your thought process, and how do you read the audience for that? Often you you start a little slower, a little softer. more softer, yeah. and then you try. Why? To, just to yeah, read, see what, and you, then you can try another song who is a little and tougher. It's a, and because if you if you start like at um, nine uh, o'clock in the evening. You know that it's gonna be a, a calmer mood. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So then you you start with a, a softer, more yeah. softer touch. So is it a difference depending on what type of gig you have? If it's like small pub, if it's off the ski, if it's a birthday, yes, uh, or if yeah. it's a Absolutely. nightclub. Nightclub. Well, well, what's what's the difference? How do you approach? Let's say. Let's say you you're you're performing in a small club for 50 people. How do you start? Yeah, probably some proud Mary. Probably, <laughs> probably, but, but, yeah, something like that. No, no, maybe not proud Mary, but uh, something yes, middle of the road. Yeah, middle, yeah, yeah, middle of the road. And and not, an after ski, thousand people on a big after ski. Then it's just get out there and all in, all in, yeah. Energy. Yeah. Okay. No, I said wrong song. Not proud Mary. Probably uh, all right now. No. Or da 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 da. Mustang. Mustang. That's okay. That's a show starting. Good song yeah. to start. Uh, a, li a little groovy. <laughs> yeah. Not uh, rock and roll, but yes. a little groovy. Yeah. But you're you're only three. In, yeah. in the band, uh, there's drums and bass and guitar and two vocals. It's one too much. It's one too much. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and your bass drum <laughs> is a little too small. Yeah, it? yeah, mm, yeah. <laughs> but uh, you play songs that maybe it's not uh, so familiar with the rock trio. So you you play a lot of pop songs uh, and stuff like that. Also, how do you arrange it? How do you think about when you're arranging it? You have to, like a foundation, me and Richard on the drums, you, know, you try to make a, a foundation that can be playable. And yeah. then to be on the guitar has to do all the... Play all the time. Oh, yeah, play all the time. <laughs> or the, like, if there's a, a keyboard thing that is very... What's the name? Like prominent? Yeah, well, exactly. Uh, prominent for the song. Yeah. It needs to be there. Yeah. It probably has to do that. Oh, so you don't have to? I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm yeah, guessing... It, it's always fun to make like uh, uh, songs who, who got like uh, keyboards and, yeah. and two guitars and, and make them in a trio. Yeah. yeah. And, 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 you, and to find the, the, um, the thing, essence yeah. or the thing with the song. Is that like this uh, uh, part of the fun challenging element yeah. yes yeah, i yeah. think so yes yeah. absolutely and the yeah and i'm guessing uh, i'm guessing here that because you're a trio you have to work a lot with dynamics yeah. because you don't have an extra instrument to put in on the chorus or something so you have to work a lot with that yeah yes and especially the guitar have to play a lot more yeah to fill it up yes yeah. mm -hmm. Who 
cool. And you travel with your own gear. Yeah. Yeah. So everything that is on stage, yeah. most of the gigs most is your yeah. own gear. The PA, the microphones, yeah. the back like, The half is stolen, but it's... <laughs> <laughs> is there a constant search for what gear to use? Yes, for for the guitarist. <laughs> yes. No, yeah. no, no. But tell me, tell me, what do you what do you think about? I will, I will never change drums. You found, you found your kit. Yes. <laughs> if you were going to buy a PA, for example, mm. uh, what what is uh, what is it you're looking for in a PA system? It helps to be light, and carryable. Car yeah. 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 Um, and big. <laughs> big. <yeah>. Uh oh. <laughs> and, uh, A bit contradictive, but yeah. Uh, yeah. And you can uh, play. Uh, it's gonna be easy to set up and, yeah. and, and move, but still. I had a lot of headroom. Yeah. Yeah. And still be able good, to play. Good. And a good punch. At least 500 people. Uh, at least 500 yeah. people, yeah. Mm. But the, the first thing you mentioned was that. It, it has to be light mm. and carryable, and that is because you're three people yeah, and you're yeah. traveling uh, with your own gear, so it have, you and have we don't, to. And we don't want to break the bus <laughs> or your bags. We, we, we have broken two buses. You have broken two buses <laughs> with heavy, heavy equipment. <laughs> okay, okay, I see. That's why the bass player have an H10. Yes, that's in, one, two. one, two. Instead, instead of two, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if we have more room in the bus, he would have two. Yeah. yeah. What type of gigs are most fun? What do you look forward to the most? Any gig can be fun. If, if, if there are five people in front of the stage yes. having a good time dancing and shouting. That's that we fun. connect yeah. with. Yeah. 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 And yeah. if they're a thousand people doing the same. It's that's the fun thing. So, so what you're saying is you try to be open-minded for every situation, every yes. gig, and and just take it as it comes. Yeah. yeah. And have and try to do the best thing of whatever yeah. place you're in. How do you get the gigs? And we played for twenty-three years now, so. I the area that we play, people know about us. Yes. Okay. So, how do you keep the gigs? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you have that's you that's have good, good uh, employers that uh, employ you for after ski in yeah. Hemavan, for example. How do you keep the gigs so that so they employ you the next winter as well? That's Just right. be friendly yeah. to to the <laughs> everyone and and. Um, of course, you have to. You can't. You have to play, play good, and play well. And uh, I don't know. but well, do you say if they see that people like this, uh, th that's the main thing. You you can't come back to 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 a place if you don't make anything there. Okay, what you're it's saying now is like it's three parts in this. It's it's you have to perform well. You have to be able to entertain the audience yes. so they like you. But you That's also have thing. to make connection with the staff and the owner yeah. and, yeah. Uh, yes. and the, the chemistry. With the, yeah. Are they equally important, you think? I would say so, probably. Yeah. But the, the, the performing the, well. Yes, the, or, or the yeah. entertainment is... is yeah, it's, it's the main thing, I yeah, think. The entertainment, yeah. that yes. people have fun. Yes, and... Yeah. and, and Sometimes the, you, you don't... And then, then you they don't sell. even play that much. And you just stand there talking. <laughs> and, and, and connect with the, with the audience. And, and, and some, gay, yeah. some gigs you, you play all the time with, without saying yeah. a word. Yeah. Or the owner of the play see that, oh, this band sells beer. Oh yeah. yeah, and because the the, the bar yeah, is it, what's it, paying yeah. you, yeah. it, it at the all end. cooks down to that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they sell food and they sell beer, and a lot of people come. That's what or makes. Or if they don't sell, we buy them. Yeah, yeah. Or, well, or, yeah, but... <laughs> well, thank you. 
Um, nice to meet you again, and I hope you have a good gig tonight. I have seven questions for you. Okay. A segment I call Seven Quick Ones. Uh, you have to make you united. United? United. Yeah, united. You have, to, you have to come up with an answer together. Okay. After ski in the afternoon or evening in a club? Both, but after, after ski, ski is yeah. something special. Yeah. After ski. Mostly, yeah. yes. Okay. Waltz or samba? I say waltz. Waltz. I say samba. Uh, well, you have to. You have to be <laughs> united here. Oh, oh. Okay, I go for waltz. <laughs> you go for waltz also. <laughs> Fifty people in a venue for a hundred, or five hundred people in a venue for ten thousand. The first one. Fifty. Yeah. Fifty, 50 people yeah. in a in a small. And you uh, probably know them all. Yes. <laughs> okay, you're gonna hate me for this question. Yeah. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're, you're never gonna talk to me again for this question. But uh, I have to, I have to say, it. playing an AZDZ song without a guitar or with a keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> That's without the guitar. Yeah. Easy. Easy. <laughs> because <laughs> keyboards in AZDZ songs are totally illegal. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. Uh, boots or Converse? Boots. Yeah. Boots. boots. <laughs> okay. 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 In, the <laughs> in the touring bus, music or silence? Silence. And the last one, cross-country skiing or snowboard? Cross-country. Cross-country. Oh, you two against one here. So thank you, and uh, I will see you again. And uh, Roger, that. that.